everyone, I'm Janice and welcome back to my channel. So today's video will be another makeup tutorial. I wanna try to do a Valentine's Day makeup look, which it's like a date night look lah. I'm thinking of date nights being a pinkish kind of makeup look and I'm not the best at it because I hardly try pink eyeshadows and stuff but today we will try it together and see how it goes so let's get started. <laughs> Okay, first thing first, we need to prime our eyes. So I'll be using this. This is from Remo. Yeah, it's all right. So while we let the eye primer dry, I am going to show you what palettes I'm going to use today. I'm thinking of using either of this ColourPop one. So this is the Give It To Me shade. A lot more pink. The other one is this You Had Me at Hello palette. This one's less of less pink I would say but still has a little pink and purple with it. I think I'll probably go with this for the main eye look and then maybe add on some glitter or anything from here. For date night looks I think pink would be a very very good kind of eyeshadow look but remember you want to look too dramatic or over the top. We want it to be kind of a bit simple but nice or so. You don't want uh you to think it's too crazy, too dramatic. So not too not a too bold kind of look. Lah. So we'll try together. Okay. I'll first use this like pink shade metal effect. Go all over my lid. So for the next one I'm thinking of going in with this colour over here, down right and kind of over my lid as well but I don't want to get it too into the corner like slightly into the corner from the mid maybe like one third kind of thing all the way to the end then I want to go into this, you had me at Halos palettes, this colour over here, this is called Full Rush. Over here. I want to add a little bit more dimension to colour, so I'm going to put it in the from the middle all the way to the back. Since it's a slightly darker. mix both together and try to add it in the crease and then I'm going to go back to the Vit to Me shade palette and I'm going to go into uh, this color TMI take, it, take a little bit of it and then I want to put it at the corner of my eyelid so like a little bit of purple not too much because I don't want to go too dramatic so I was thinking I want to focus more on pink so but a little bit of purple will add a little bit more dimension and colours to my eyes. So it's very nice. I think that's about it. Maybe I'll add a little more pink and all after I blend it. So I'm going to blend it first. Get back to matter of fact. Down right, and what's the other color? Full rush back. Yeah. Not forgetting to add TMI back into the corner as well. Okay, so before I add any glitter on, I want to draw my lower lash line so I am going to mix TMI a little bit of TMI with a little bit of full rush over here right here yep. 
Okay, and then that's about it for the shadow now. Uh, I need to decide on what glitter I want to use. So this is straight up, and this is what oh, is so. This is fourth right. This two are from the give it to me shit palette. And then for this, you had me at Hello. Oh, I'm thinking of this color. This is. Look, see this color over here. Let's just swatch it. Oh, that's very pretty. Yeah. I think I'm um, going with a bit of shade up and forth, right? Lah. Then maybe I'll add on a little bit of the look see. We'll see how. <laughs> so first let's add shade up. And to the center right here. I'll be very gentle with this, don't want to put too much. I want a little bit of glitter but not over the top kind of glitter. So like a little bit of it over here. And then going back to fourth right. Fourth right is a bit flat. It's like very fun, you know. Uh, so let's be very careful with it. So put a little bit on top. Okay, maybe I should add a li little bit of looksy at the end lah of where the glitter is at now. So basically right over here. Just one dot a bit a bit. Let's just do the other side first and then We'll go into eyeliner and mascara for finishing up the entire face. Now let's go into eyeliner and mascara before I show you a finished eye look. So as usual, I'm going to use this K palette one. This is brown black, and I want to go more Koreanish kind of eyeliner. So basically, if you see right here, it goes downwards instead of uh, wings upwards. I think this one is like a sweeter kind of look, kind of fit what I want today. So we definitely have to do some mascara. So, using this same one from Etude House again. Just hold I'm using this one from Beam Oh, this is the Lasting Finish Soft Color Blush in Pink Rose. I really like this. It's suitable for like everyday look use as well. I definitely need some highlight again. Where's my? Yeah, this one from Becca. And last but not least, definitely a lipstick. I'm going to go with this one from Lancome. This is two nut, yeah, La Absolute Rook. I have no idea how we in two nine five Cafe Parisian. To show you how this looks like, it's just a very a sweet pink and really kind of pink colors. Oh man, it's so pink. It's not super pink, but I'm not used to pink. I've been liking uh, our radish lips more for the past 
maybe like seven, eight, nine, ten months, I don't know. Since last year. So I'm not too into this kind of colours recently, but looks not bad too. This is the finished look. What do you guys think? Let me just show you a close-up of it. What do you guys think? It is kind of like my first time in a very long time trying a pink eyeshadow look. Pink and purple eyeshadow look. I haven't been into this looks for so, so long already. I've been always in a yellowy orange colour. So I don't know how it looks. Let me know how do I look in such a look in the comments. And <laughs> I hope you learned something from this video. It's a bit all of the place, but yeah, I'm just trying out a new look. And I'm so happy you're along, uh, you're in this journey with me today. So thank you so much for watching. And please remember to subscribe to my channel. And I'll be uploading every weekend. So see you guys next time. Bye.